Ladies and gentlemen, I'm about to unleash a tirade of epic proportions. A rant that bubbles up from the depths of personal space invasion. I'm talking about the infuriating phenomenon of people touching me in public places. It's like they've forgotten the unwritten code of the public domain. And I'm here to remind them with a slap of reality. Picture this. You're navigating through the chaotic jungle of a crowded city street, a bustling mall, or perhaps a cramped elevator. You're just an innocent bystander, minding your own business, trying to get from point A to point B without becoming a human pincushion. But what happens, it's like a circus act of unintended physical contact. First, the inadvertent shoulder bump. It's like they're playing a real-life game of human pinball using you as the bump player. Excuse me, you say, attempting to assert your personal territory, but no, they're on their merry way, bouncing off you like a stray asteroid hurtling through space, completely unaware of the collision course they've set. And don't get me started on the casual brush-up. You're waiting in line, innocently perusing the canned soup aisle, and suddenly someone's elbow becomes an unwelcome squatter in your personal space. They stand so close that you can practically hear their inner monologue. Back off, you think, but you don't say it because, well, you're in the grocery store, not the boxing ring. But then there's the pièce de résistance, the surprise, intimate hug from a stranger. You're standing there, perhaps daydreaming about what you'll have for dinner, and someone you've never met decides it's the perfect moment for a spontaneous embrace. Oh, I thought you were someone else, they say. As if that's a free pass for an unauthorized cuddle session. It's like they've mistaken the street corner for a cozy family reunion. But wait, there's more! They have excuses. Oh, yes! It's crowded. I had no choice, they claim. As if their lack of spatial awareness is somehow your problem. It was an accident, they say. As if that erases the awkwardness of the encounter. I didn't mean to, they say, as if that makes the awkward encounter disappear into the ether. Hey, they're like accidental contortionists, bending and twisting their logic to fit the circumstances. It's like they're all part of a secret society of space invaders, a club of inadvertent touchy-feely enthusiasts. They're like magnets, drawn to you at the most inconvenient times. As if personal boundaries are mere suggestions, not sacred lines not to be crossed. But let me tell you, my fellow sufferers of unsolicited touch, we won't stand for it. We won't let the conspiracy of public touchiness break our spirits. We'll navigate these crowded streets, tight elevators and shopping malls with our personal space intact and our sense of humor as impenetrable as a medieval fortress. Because if they think they can touch us in public without consequence, they've got another thing coming. <laughs>